today is my first attempt this year to go up Waschangrad and continue to Gefferspitz, two of the highest mountains around here. It's gonna be a very long day, very exhausting day. I really want to get this done. There's a restaurant and a private club and it took me exactly two hours from door to door. I'm not at the very top. That's basically where I'm heading. The top of Wassangrad. After that, I'm gonna go up on the big one behind me. That's my goal for today. I am not too sure if I can make it to the very top. It looks very, very far away and very high. It is far away and it is very high. I'm really out of breath. I have no idea why. Maybe it's the altitude, maybe I'm completely out of shape. Maybe I'm just getting old. Vassangrad is one of the more memorable hikes I've done in my life so far. This can only be topped by the Grouse Mountain in Vancouver, Canada and the Big Chief next to Vancouver. Whoa. And of course the ones I did in Yosemite National Park a couple of years ago. But as far as Switzerland is concerned, this is, whoa, this is the most fun I've had so far. My end goal today, Giffa Spitz up there. Those are all weather shoes, not really hiking, but much better than the sailing shoes I was hiking with the last couple of years, which did me a great service, but you know, as far as safety is concerned, probably not the best option. Hikes like this really help me calm down and relax and appreciate all the beauty that's around me in nature. Couldn't think of anything better to do today. I don't need music or company. I do have music for my way home, but so far I'm just enjoying the quietness and the nature and the fact that I'm alive and healthy. Long way home. That's the beauty about hiking alone. You have to do everything by yourself. Put the camera down, press play, run down where my stuff is, run back up. I'm gonna change the setting and do the same again. I will try to make my way up here to the very top. I'm not sure if I can get to this top. I've been about here last year when I was climbing up here and I went over the ridge. Couldn't get over the very top so I went down. That was a complete nightmare. Took me all day. Very, very exhausting. This is so much fun. But it's draining my battery life. Ah. I just got hit by a stone. It's a shelter. We are nevertheless a long way from home. Kind of high up in the mountains. So if the weather turns, then you've got a nice place to hide. So that's all the luxury you get in here. Okay, you don't actually have anything, no water, but you've got shelter. Quite nice. I could definitely see myself spending the night here if I had to. 
Yeah, not tonight. I still have plans. There's an outbuilding. Looks like a toilet. I highly doubt it. I think it's more some like tool shed or something. Well, and it's closed actually. Well, well that's a screw. So screw this. Whoop. Uh, whoa. Yeah, that's what you. Whoa, Peter. That's what you basically should not do in the mountains. To jump where you don't see where you are going because you can easily break your ankle and then the day is over and you need to call for rescue. There's a sign with water. Ah, so due to water shortage there's no water. I'm starting to feel my knees. What's all the noise up there? Oh, I'm starving. Super hungry, super exhausted. Energy is gone. This is porridge and stewed apples with honey and salt. I'm completely knackered. The last bit was like super exhausting. I had to take breaks every every 10 meters. Really out of breath. Oh, finally. It's three hours to the village and then it's another hour at least to back to the city. So I'm four hours away from home. It took me six hours to get up here. I'm gonna continue over there that way and make my way down. It's already five o'clock, so uh, I won't be home before nine. And get down. I will outrun them, that's for sure. I don't really want to have the whole collage behind me. Oh, this is beautiful. I can really feel my legs now. Really, really hurting here. Very steep to the left and to the right. Finally. Gefferspitz. Nice. Very, very nice. What a view! Coming up here, going all along, down here, up here. Tip top! Oh man! I'm slowly but surely getting sick of this. Climbing down is always the hardest, the most dangerous. You can slip, you can break an ankle, you can just fall off of the mountain. I've been hiking for eight hours and still a long way to go. And even from the house down there, it's another like almost two hours to go back home. Well, let's make it an hour and a half, but I'm tired. I'm really slowing down. I have half a liter of water and half of my porridge left. That's a good thing. I have a rain jacket, even better. But my knees and my ankle and my feet really hurt with every step I take. Every step I take, every move I make. Okay, it's soon time to listen to some music because I am getting crazy. My knees are killing me. Oh, putain. Oh. Every 
every step hurts. It's uh, here, 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 here. Oh, man. Oh. Oh. I wish I stayed home. Oh. I've come to a point where every step really, really hurts. I passed a sign 10 minutes ago, 2 hours 15 to start. So at my current pace, make it 3 hours. It is quarter to 8. I can't really remember when the sun sets, probably in an hour and a half. If I make it to the main road, before it gets dark, I will be very happy. But oh, my knees, man, my knees. Oh, maybe this was just a bit too much. But I had so much fun. I think everything is good. I just got a lift. A farmer just drove me at least, I don't know, like two kilometers closer to the city. He saw me coming down and he was like, ah, you look tired, I'm gonna give you a lift. The last bit of sun up on Gefferspitz. So glad I did this. Ah, I don't really know what I should do once I get home. Take a shower, of course, have a cold Coke. Maybe definitely a nice cup of black tea. Maybe something to eat as well, I'm not too sure. I only had porridge today and a banana and two energy bars. I spent 10 and a half hours hiking. I thought I would be home earlier as usual, but I'm back in the city. I'm completely done. See you next time. Have a good one. Bye bye. Oh, this was fun. See you later. Bye.